Welcome to this quick video, yet another one about Azure Remote Rendering with the HoloLens 2. But today I have a very special 3D model here, which is, uh, as some of you might have guessed it, the Space Shuttle Discovery, which is here presented by the Smithsonian. So the Smithsonian has it on display, and the Smithsonian Public uh, Open Access has that also as a 3D photogrammetry scan available. So someone did the uh, extra hard work and you know, made a really nice photogrammetry 3D scan. And I downloaded that and run it through Azure Remote Rendering Pipeline. And now I'm able to visualize that here on the HoloLens, which would not be possible without Azure Remote Rendering. Of course, this is a millions of polygons model. And Azure Remote Rendering is rendering that on these powerful Azure GPU VMs. And so we can visualize that here. Um, we are live streaming. And in fact, I'm actually streaming that via my mobile phone hotspot at the moment. It's around 15 to 20 Mbit via LTE or 4G. But actually, let me place the model back there again. And so we can also you know, view it inside. And here are the wingtips, for example. And as you can see, it's a one-to-one -one scale. So very huge and very impressive, of course. It's pretty cool also, as you can see, these tiles there. Um, in the video, it might be a little bit jittery and lagging because, you know, um, this is because the HoloLens uses late-state reprojection, but the uh, mixed reality video capture does not apply that. So it's a little bit tough to actually uh, see it without your own eyes in a stable manner, right? But it's really nice and stable. But anyway, um, just wanted to show you that we can create these digital twins of real-world objects rather quickly and can then visualize them with the power of the HoloLens in mixed reality and then with Azure rendering with these huge models. All right, folks, thanks for watching and take care and stay safe.